Hey everybody, Ricky of Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing from the Big A Aqueduct Race Course Ozone Park, New York on Saturday afternoon, January the 13th. Handicapping, of course, for dayatthetrack.com. Let's take a look at one of two stake races on the card this afternoon. It's race number 5, 2.17 p.m. Eastern Post Time. This is the Say Florida Sandy Stakes, 7 furlong sprint on the dirt. Four-year-olds and up racing for a stakes prize of $100,000. Contenders number four, my boy Tate. Number one, Astro Lenka. Number six, I love Lulu. And number three, Celtic Chaos. Stakes race is restricted to New York breads only, named after, say, Florida Sandy. Dark brown colt made a name for himself in New York and on the East Coast, winning the 2001 New York Bread Horse of the Year Award. Here in the initial running of the Sandy, number four, my boy Tate, both the overall speed and pace profile leader, has hit the board in each of his last five, winning three times, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Number one, Astro Lenka, a four-to-one shot, has hit the board in four of his last five, including a circle trip in the second race back. Race five summary, number four, my boy Tate. Tops the contenders list today here at Aqueduct, which also includes number one, Ostrolenka, number six, I Love Lulu, and number three, Celtic Chaos, 4163, and the fifth from Aqueduct, the $100,000, say, Florida Sandy Stakes. Bonus long shots, Charlestown, race 10, the 10 to 1 bomb. Number six, the Lady is a Lion, comes off a power run win in her last start. Mahoning Valley Race Course, race 5, the speed leader in this field, racing at or about today's distance of a mile and 70 yards on the dirt is the 15 to 1 bomb, number 10, Midnight Dance. So handicapping from Aqueduct on a Saturday, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.